everybody. My name is Harini Kumar. I am an RF Applications Engineer with the Control Products Group at Analog Devices. Our product line has switches, attenuators, and front-end modules. In this video, I will introduce the industry's first die-on carrier product, the ADRF5424. The ADRF5424 is a reflective SPDT single-pole double-throw switch and can operate from 100 MHz to 60 GHz. This enlarged 3D model of the ADRF5424 is to help explain its structure better. The die-on carrier is a silicon die flipped and bumped using a proprietary process onto a gallium arsenide gas carrier substrate. This gas carrier has RF and digital bond pads that can be wire bonded to. Using advanced packaging technology, we are able to provide the enhanced product performance and features of the silicon dyes in a wire bondable die-like form. The die-on carrier does not have any additional handling requirements. You can use the standard die handling procedures. The ADRF5424 will be available in waffle packs or gel packs. These designs are a good alternative to the traditional gas and pin diode dye solutions as it offers ultra-wideband performance and is extremely easy to use. It also allows for higher integration capability. The ADRF5424 is available in a small form factor of 2.5 mm by 2.6 mm. The Dion carrier has same or similar performances to the plastic packaged LGA parts. Shown here is a probe station used for the characterization of the ADRF5424. The RF pads on the gas die are designed to match to a 2.5 mm by 0.5 mm ribbon bond wire, 3 mm in length. There is no additional matching circuitry needed on the RF pads on the PCB. On the screen here, we see a ground signal ground 300 micrometer pitch probe touching down on the RF pads. The ADRF5424 has an integrated CMOS TTL logic compatible digital circuitry. Therefore, no external bias or driver circuitry is needed, making it extremely easy to use. This part requires a positive and a negative voltage supply to operate, and it needs a control voltage to switch between states. The part draws very low current of 2 microamps of VDD and 110 microamps of VSS. The silicon process itself has competitive advantages over other processes. Using cutting edge design techniques, we can achieve ultra low insertion loss while going higher in frequency. The ADRF5424 has 1.2 dB of insertion loss at 40 GHz and only 2 dB of insertion loss at 60 GHz making it ideal for a variety of applications. The part exhibits a relatively flat insertion loss over the entire frequency range. The ADRF5424 has high isolation across the entire frequency band of greater than 35 dB. It also offers high linearity and has a high power handling of 27 dBm on the through path and 27 dBm on the hot switching. As the switch is designed on the silicon process, the ADRF5424 is a good candidate for high reliability applications. It is robust with good ESD performance. The process is immune to latch up and has radiation hardness. This silicon switch also has fast switching speed of 10 nanoseconds and a fast RF settling time as well. The RF settles to 0.1 dB of the final value in 17 nanoseconds. At Analog Devices, we understand that high-frequency RF designs can be challenging. We highly recommend running full 3D EM simulations to lay out RF PCB boards. We can help review and offer our design guidance around our high-frequency RF products to achieve optimum performance. For more information, you can visit analog.com slash ADRF5424. Please feel free to contact us should you have any questions. Thank you.